What is up, YouTube? My name is Carla. Welcome to Teaching Trends, where I teach all about the updates to remote jobs, what's changing in YouTube, and jobs on social media. So we're going to jump right into our quick tip of the day. Many people have been expressing they're having issues with playing videos, editing videos. There's been issues with the monetization sign not appearing or an exclamation point of some sort. So YouTube is saying that all of these issues could be coming from just one place. So I'm going to talk just really quickly about that today. YouTube is stating that you should update your YouTube video app and you should also update your YouTube studio app. Many people are talking about they are having some difficulty, but for the best experience, YouTube is saying you should do this. They have been updating some features, as it says here, updates to make things faster, making fixes, and even more. So if you haven't updated your app in a while, you should. YouTube states that they have been sending updates to people for quite some time, and this is true. You might need to update and reboot. When I look back at my videos and I look back at my YouTube emails and in my YouTube studio, there were like nine updates in there. Keep in mind, I've only been on YouTube for seven months, and I know I didn't update my app that many times, so YouTube says that this is something that they will do. Now, you may say, you know, I've already updated the app. That is not my issue. However, you might need to know that some of the apps and some of the changes require new permissions. And you're probably like, what? Notice right here, new permissions when the apps are updated. So if you haven't gone in to accept these new permissions, some of the tabs, some of the apps, and some of the things may not work. So when we go into new permissions, you have to allow some of the apps and features to actually work and to be used on your phone. You may have to allow and deny them and also check your version of your phone if it's Android or Apple. They do have other changes as well in privacy changes and privacy management. So you will need to actually deny or accept some of these permissions as well. Different types of permissions are the calendars, camera, contacts, microphone, activity, files, and media. So some of your files and media may actually be there. They've also disabled some things for privacy. So things that may have worked before, you may have to turn back on. So make sure you know that even though you may have updated your app, there may be some changes in permission. And again, updating with the YouTube Studio app and updates with YouTube. So you might have to go in and go in to get that update. There are some other things you may have to do as well in their section as far as their Play Store and updates, if you've downloaded some other functions from there. But the main idea here is to update your YouTube Studio and YouTube Studio app. For some more changes in YouTube, click right here and check out this thumbnail.